Yeah, 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 yeah. What's good, my people? Flex, I just wanna win. Yeah, LA BB, who we running with? Yeah, two, two, three, three, I'm on ten again. Yeah, state your name. Yes, guys, what are you telling me? Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. As you can tell from the title, got some pretty good news. I can't lie to you, lot. It's looking a bit, it's looking a bit nice for the boy. Hey guys, I got some news to speak to you about. Um, but I'm just gonna get a nice little, um, like little ball mastery session in, um, a little bit of running and stuff, uh, just to keep me ticking over and get me ready for my next adventure that I'm gonna be doing. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be crazy, guys. But guys, I have actually got some new boots. All right, now these are beautiful. Let me get them out. Let me show you what I've got. Yeah. Oh, look at these. The anti clog soft ground uh, phantom. I think, I don't know, are they hyperventers? I don't actually know. Uh, they were on offer, so I thought I'd cop them for my new adventure that I'm going to be doing. So, yeah, I've got these, and I've also still got my custom molds that I have um, that I'm going to be taking as well. But yeah, guys, fresh set of boots. Obviously, whenever you get a new pair of football boots, it's always good to try and wear them in um, so you don't get like blisters and stuff, especially like when you're going to be starting to play games or etc. like that. So you don't want to be wearing brand new boots um, when you go into games and stuff because it's not really good for your feet. So uh, yeah, make sure you get these. And also, if you don't know already, I put this on the floor. As you can see, the grip socks I'm wearing right now. Them bad boys, I have actually just released them. They're my own brand. Um, I put a lot of hard work and thought into these, okay? It's, it's taken me about eight, nine months to get these released just because I wanted to make sure they're perfect, the design was perfect, the quality, etc. Um, invested good money into this. So if any of you guys want to cop some, you know, rep the CPG socks, the army, they're flary, so you might have to have a little bit of tech, but they're made for anyone. Um, footballers wear these grip socks, just have better comfort, um, better grip and, within the football boot and stuff. So if you want to cop something, it'll help me out massively, um, support me on my journey and what I'm trying to do. Yeah, go to the CPG website, it's in the description down below. Go follow the Instagram as well, and uh, yeah. All right, we've got the fresh boots on. They're looking nice, I can't lie to you lot. You can see myself scoring a few goals in these. But yeah, they're really comfy. But guys, the best way to wear some football boots are when you first get them, wear them around the house for a little bit, for a couple hours. Um, just let them mold and break into them a bit before you really go out and train them. Because if you literally whack on a brand new pair of boots and go train straight away without like wearing them in around your house a little bit, um, yeah, it can be blister central, right? It can really mess you up. So don't want blisters because they're flipping painful, right? But yeah, let's get into a nice little sesh. What the old airpod air in? I've got a bit of a headache, I can't lie. I'm still out here grafting, yeah? Don't care if my head's pounding. Hey. Guys, as you can see right here, yeah? Whoever that legend is, Siri Burge. Man, that's like Siri, and I just bought some socks. Hey, Siri, thanks. Oh, but yeah, Siri Burge just bought some socks. I get a little notification like this. Yeah, absolute legend. So, make sure you go cop your socks, yeah? Cheers, Siri. Best song right now. Drake, what's next? Listen to it. Now let me play football. Alright guys, I'm gonna give you like a little challenge, yeah? And if any of you would want to do it, tag me on Insta, I'll repost it. And uh, yeah, so what is the keep you up challenge, right? How many can you do? So it's gonna be like, you have to alternate from right leg to left leg. It's really good at improving control and uh, being good on both feet. So it'll be like one, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six. You, you get a draw. We'll see what we can do. Right, I got seven, yeah, but I don't know what flew in my eye, but it put me off and I was like, crying. 
Yeah, guys, little challenge like that. I like doing little games and stuff like this, but yeah, I'll challenge you guys, see how many you can do. Guys, just little things like this. Um, don't need much equipment. Just try and like put yourself in match situations. You know what I mean? Um, just practice like your close ball control. It can get you out of breath quite easily because high intensity. But yeah, just practice step overs, dropping the shoulder. Imagine you're in a game. You know what I mean? Like you imagine the situations, them moving. You know what I mean? You like a lot of. I don't really know what comparison I'm trying to make, but you see a lot of boxers do like shadow boxing. They imagine themselves in the in the ring. You know what I mean? I feel like you can sort of integrate that into like your football training and stuff, especially with things like this. And you're just running around with a ball, doing little step overs and stuff, just to try and like imagine putting yourself in game situations, you know? Woo! Man nearly done the ACL ankle, all of that. It's pitching great guys, so please be careful. Just a set of six runs, high intensity. There, back, there, back, there, back. Comment down below if you hate running, because I do. Bad yeah. <sighs> Guys, so just finished the little sesh, nothing too major. Just done a few sets of running, obviously just a bit of like ball mastery stuff and that. But yeah, let's have a little chit chat, got some mad news. So basically guys, I am at the end of this month in March, um, it's looking like the 28th right now. I'm actually leaving the country um, to join a new team. So yeah guys, it's pretty nuts. Um, obviously, I haven't been able to play football for the last four months really because of covid you know um my league got cancelled etc and for someone like me i've been through a lot okay so i've had big injuries i've missed a lot of football obviously i've done my acl and that um and i've never really i haven't had a full season in a long time so my last full season was when i was like 16 okay yeah my last full season um was quite a long time ago if you are new around here i used to play for norwich city um, I was a pro there and yeah, I suffered quite a lot of injuries. But yeah, but since then, obviously I joined a new team, started off well, and then COVID came about. So uh, yeah, I feel like I've been stuck in pre season for a long time, right? but I'm, I'm leaving the country end of this month. It's come around so quick, the opportunity come about. Um, and I just thought, you know what, I'm just going to go for it. Um, I'm leaving everyone behind, friends, family, you know, summer's coming up here in the UK, it's going to be a shutdown, but you know, your boys got to grow up. I want to play football, right? That's what, that's the end goal. I want to be a professional footballer. And this is just going to be all a part of the journey. I'm going to show all of you guys as well. So the manager, um, I get on with him really, really well. He's an English manager as well. Um, he loves what I do with the YouTube and stuff. And he wants me to film everything, document everything, show everyone my journey, what it's like. Um, so yeah, things are looking forward, all right? And I just want to, I want to, the whole reason why I want to do this YouTube, um, I just want to inspire and motivate you guys that there's different pathways, okay? It's not just all about going through academies. If you get released from an academy, it's not the end of the world, all right? Keep your head down, keep focused, and I just want to show a pathway, and I, want, and I will, I will make it 
to being a professional footballer playing at a good level because I believe in my ability and I know the ability I've got and I'm just gonna, I just want to show you guys okay what it takes to do that and uh, yeah you're gonna be with me every step of the way it's gonna be crazy I'm not gonna say what country it is um, I'm just gonna put a little teaser out there you know what I mean get a little bit of hype going but yeah guys I'm gonna be playing games next month your boy's gonna be banging goals and that you get me grafting I'm um, gonna continue gonna get ready for this for our new team um so yeah going forward i'm gonna be at this club in this country for a minimum of six months all right um and then after that i'll either decide if i want to come back to the uk or most likely i'm gonna be going some somewhere else in europe okay um well there's a little tease there. it's in europe if you don't know comment down below what country you want me to come to or what country you think it might be most likely i probably won't come back to the uk this year or after my my little spell at this club um journey's gonna be crazy guys and you lot are gonna be with me but yeah i just wanted to get that bit of information out there just so you guys know what's gonna be happening coming forward you guys have something to look forward to the youtube content is gonna be crazy it's gonna be one massive journey to the top um so if you guys want to follow along please hit that subscribe button we're so close to 50,000. we're literally nearly there from from right now we're literally like 200 150 or so when this video goes out from here, I fucking love you, yeah? I love you, yeah? It's crazy, 50,000 mad. But if you haven't, you're pagan, yeah? If you haven't liked it as well, you can see that like button, you haven't liked it, yeah? You're pagan. That is disgraceful if you haven't done that. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna end the little vlog there. Um, nothing special. But yeah, guys, like I always say, stay positive, stay grinding, and I'll see you in the next one.